Hey, what's up everybody? It's Ryan Oakley here and welcome to the wedding photography gig tutorial where I'm showing you how to create your own professional wedding photography website and this is step three and in step three uh, well first what did we do in step two? Step two uh, we've already uploaded our first gallery and we've uh, uh, changed some of the gallery settings in here and now in step three uh, we're gonna go ahead and upload uh, a few more client galleries to fill out our site and I'm gonna show you how we're gonna uh, uh, quickly change the uh, the gallery settings for those three new galleries uh, without uh, having to go through each option in the gallery settings page I'm gonna show you how to do that and uh, and I'm gonna show you if you need to make a change on multiple galleries in the gallery settings I'm going to show you how to quickly and easily do that as well alright so let's get to it so I'm going to go back into client which is our category and I'm going to go ahead and go and you should do this too let's upload a couple more galleries and fill this thing out so hopefully you've got uh, a couple more I'm going to do the same um, I'm going to create a new gallery in because it knows I'm in the client uh, um, category I'm gonna go ahead and go new gallery here. And what's my next name? My next name for my clients are Amy and David. So let's do Amy and David. So I'll just remind everybody how to do this even though um, we did it already once. And then uh, after I've done this, I'm gonna press pause on the recording and then come back when my three new galleries are up. Okay, so I've just finished uploading my gallery, my, my last gallery here. And so I'm just gonna go ahead and uh, click into it and so here's the last gallery and I'm just gonna go to client so here you can see the four galleries that I've uploaded so um, by all means uh, pause the this tutorial and go ahead and uh, and get a few galleries in there and we'll move to the next part so you can see uh, what I want to do is make sure that all my galleries are customized the same they have the same settings so you can see the Brittany and Mark's um, gallery that we had done here you can see the description info is missing on Brittany and Mark but it's showing up for all these other ones so I'm going to show you what we can do to change that and the, and the quickest way to do that when you've got multiple galleries that you want to change there's an easy way to do it so I'm going to go ahead and just pick any gallery I'm going to pick Sarah and Craig here okay so now that I'm in the gallery settings for uh, Sarah and Craig what I can do is because we had defined our quick settings in uh, in one of our first galleries there I'm just gonna go ahead and say uh, yeah I want to do the quick settings make all these settings below be the same as client gallery and apply and then I can apply quick settings to multiple galleries which I'm gonna go ahead and click that so here I want Amy and this one and this one so I'm just gonna click all three and it defaults to smug mug default but I'm gonna go ahead and say I want it to be client gallery which is the same as we've got for Brittany and Mark so I'm gonna go ahead and apply all and so now as a quick test well I'm gonna go save gotta make sure we save it and then there's a quick test I am gonna look for a couple of things that we know we uh, uh, yeah so there's the description missing or intentionally set off to keep things clean and now that's gone so now I know all of these galleries are now uh, have the same customization now if I wanted to change something in here uh, into all of these I could easily go oops, I'll just go tools client settings and I would go change settings for multiple galleries so this is where I could say okay if by default it's got Sarah and Craig but I also want I could say all of my galleries and then remove them. So let me go, hmm, let's not do all my galleries. Let's make sure we've got the certain ones. Because as you get, to, as you grow your, as you grow your uh, Smug Mug account and get lots of galleries in here, you want to make sure you're just applying to the ones that uh, that you want to. So uh, last one, I think, Amy and David, there we go. So we've got all four client galleries in here. Now, if I just wanted to change one thing, say I said, you know, geography, all of a sudden I buy a GPS camera and I don't want, um, I don't want the location information showing up anywhere. I can go geography, change that to no. When I hit save, it's going to apply to all of these galleries. So I'm going to go hit save. It's giving me a warning saying, hey, you sure we want to do this? Because this is going to 
have a lot of uh, impact and I'm fine with that. But thanks for the warning. So I'm gonna go ahead and say yes. And there we go. So that is uh, the end of step two of our tutorial. And uh, come join me on step three. All right, talk to you later.